at Camus Fontaine Farm and I'm staying at the silo as you can see behind me. I'm gonna show you around, so let's go! Today I'm next to Malmesbury, about an hour drive from Cape Town, staying at the working wine farm of Calmus Fontaine. This is the main facade of the silo that you see from your parking lot area. It has so many trees and leaves surrounding it and it adds some character. The silo has an entrance at the back, but before we go inside, let's have a look around. Coming up this beautiful stone stairs to the main entrance, we see a gate that gives us access to a greenhouse with plants and a swinging chair overlooking the silo. Then if we go to the other side to the right, we will find a staircase that goes down to a very basic kitchen with a burner gas stove. Fresh farm eggs are always available. The silo has no stove, so you need to go outside for that. Next to the kitchen, there's an amazing porch area with some comfy chairs and a table. Here, there's another swinging chair that's perfect to enjoy a little sundowner drink by the pool. The trees next to the porch have stunning red leaves and the pool has a key shape with different depths. Now, let's go inside of the silo. You need to go up the staircase and when you get in, you've got the kitchen to your left and the bathroom to the right. The first thing we notice is there is a freshly baked bed. You get one on each accommodation you book on the farm. On the exposed shelves, there's coffee, tea, granola and rusks. There's a mini fridge with a cup full of butter, wine from the farm and spirits and mixers. I love accommodations that put some effort into the small things. It makes such a big difference. If we continue straight, we're at the lounge area with two comfortable chairs and a table. If we push in, we're already in the bedroom. We have three windows with views of the farm and mountains surrounding it. It has a king bed with 50% duck, 50% goose feather, pillows and duvet. Check out the bedside tables that are halfway inside of the wall instead of poking all the way out. It's the first time that I've seen it and I think it looks really cool. There are two mirrors on each side of the room. We have a dresser area too, with two basket hangers and a bench. The bathroom has this beautiful farm wooden door. As you come in, you'll see the sink and another window overlooking the mountains. There's a wide shower area and all the products and amenities are made with locally sourced beeswax and not harmful for the environment. The mirror is inside the shower, which I found very interesting. This is it for the silo today. I hope you've enjoyed the tour. We'll be back soon with more unique accommodation tours, so make sure to subscribe and I'll see you on the next one. Bye!